wasn't paying attention to this sweet old lady with the... That's terrifying. Hey, Way Nation, I'm Becca here with... Zach Williams. And we're gonna play a game, Bible or Grandma. We're gonna be looking at quotes to see if they were inspired by the Bible or inspired by something that all grandmas just say. Now, what did you call your grandmother growing up? Uh, I called her Granny. We have the Granny. It's casual, yet still commands respect. Granny, did she have anything that was like a classic Granny catchphrase? Uh, I can remember her telling me to go pick the switch that I wanted to <laughs> That no, is a granny. She would tell me to watch my P's and Q's. Yeah, that yeah, was her thing. Yeah. I mine were both grandmas and they called me Rebecca instead of Rebecca. Uh, I got and called Zachary. Zachary. Yeah. yeah, you get the full name from grandma. Full name, so. All right, let's kick this off. Uh am I my brother's keeper? Hmm. I feel like this is an easy one, right? Feels like uh straight Bible. <laughs> yeah, it's Cain and Abel. Right, okay. Well, we this is easy. This is just the beginning. Don't put the cart before the horse. Mm. That has to be grandma, right? I cannot. I think, I think that's definitely grandma. Yeah. Grandma. Yeah. And if you were like unequally yoked with your Kinda horse. Kind of sounded like John the Baptist, but <laughs> not be grandma, so. Not that I've heard. All right, we are crushing this. Many hands make light work. Ooh, I feel like I could see this in Proverbs. Go for it. Ooh. I think you're right. Bible. Man. What? I don't know my Bible. Granny has a chapter in the Bible too, by the way. Yeah, she probably does. So, I mean, uh, most of the things that my grandmother <clears> said <throat> were straight from the Bible. Man does not live on bread alone. I love bread. Bible. Come on. I should just let you decide all of these because the <laughs> one that I was like, I got this, I did not have. Okay, we're breezing through this. Gird your loins. All right, everyone, gird your loins. Ooh. To be honest, I don't even know what this means. I don't either. The only word I know there is your. <laughs> yes, loins, like pork loins, is yeah. the closest I can get. I feel like is that, that what it means? I feel like it's a granny. Granny. <laughs> so girding your loins is like collecting your oh. skirt. Yes. But in Bible days, they weren't skirts, they were cloaks to gird. Ew! Uh, next one, bit the dust. Granny, right? I can't think of yeah. anywhere in the Bible. I think Queen said it though. Another one bites the dust. I don't but, think yeah. Granny was inspired by Queen, but, but you never I know. I think it was Granny. Golly. What? Where? <laughs> Psalm seventy-two nine. To pick three words out of the Bible and to know. I know. I know. In that context, it's pretty hard. I know. Yeah, okay. you should definitely quit Christian music. I should quit Christian radio. A Rolling Stone gathers no moss. <laughs> I mean, again, I cannot think of a biblical context for this. A Rolling Stone gathers. I'm thinking no that's moss. pretty an obvious, pretty obvious statement. It sounds like something Great. an old timer would say. An so. old time, yeah, exactly. Let's, and not like Bible old timer, with... Granny. It's Granny, Granny. Thank you. All right. Okay, I feel good. Strike while the iron is hot. Now I do know the Bible. Oh, Granny. <laughs> Okay, Boom. you didn't even think about that. That's old. I was thinking like heard iron one. sharpens iron, but you just, you no, don't mess I've heard around. you got to strike while the iron's hot. All high. right. Okay, let's see. By the skin of your teeth. I have definitely heard my grandma say that. Yes. And but I'm pretty sure that's in the Bible. You think that's in the Bible? Like David got I, away. I, I think it's. By the skin of his teeth. Bible. Yours are good. It's Job. I am nothing but skin and bones. I have escaped yep. only by the skin of my teeth. Yep. It's I have that title written down as a song I want to write. Really? Skin of my teeth, yeah. Okay, what is so, it about? That scripture, that's why I knew it. All things in moderation. It's I'm feeling- a good life quote. Bible. I'm thinking of when Paul's like, all things are permissible to me. I could also, again, see this in Proverbs. All right, do you want to go with- uh... No, because I'm always wrong, but- You do it. Or do you, what are you feeling? You do it, I think you're right. Okay, are you writing a song about this one? Because no. that would be really helpful right <laughs> no. now. Bible. Golly. I wish I could throw this. Grandma was a wise when lady. We used to do cards. You could just dramatically throw them. And just said it. Gone. It's a drop in the bucket. Sid. That sounds like a grandma saying to me. I feel like they're trying to trick us. I'm going Bible. Oh. After 
we they, picked that well, they tri- it, They're tricking us with the words. Are we on the same team? <laughs> we are. Okay. Last one. A leopard can't change his spots. I don't recall leopards in the Bible. I recall lepers. <laughs> and I feel like that'd be kind of rude <laughs> if Jesus was like... I think we both can agree that this was... Granny. 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 <laughs> Where, where, where? Do they have leopards in the Bible? Jeremiah 13:23. She looks like the Where's the Beef lady. <laughs> Is this the Where's the Beef lady? We've learned that Grandma has stolen a lot of things from the Bible because it was pretty confusing. And I think I slept during um, Bible class. <laughs> hey, you got more right than you got wrong. Okay. Good. All Good. right. That was surprisingly more difficult than I expected. Guys, let us know how well you did in the comments.